<laughs> and she's I so pretty. Oh, wow, she's. Hi guys. Uh Welcome back to my channel and for this video, we will be reacting to Miss Universe updates. Let's watch the journey of the girls in the Miss Universe 2019, guys. Must know makeup tips or this is just an update in the Miss Universe 2019, guys. So, must know makeup tips from Miss Universe Thailand. Let's watch. I don't have anything. Thailand. The look. First, I'm gonna add some eyeshadow. First, I'm gonna add eyeshadow. Oh, this is a true way. I'm to draw the eyebrow like cranes oh. neck so it starts thicker and it gets thin. Okay. Wow. So, I like to do the eyes first because uh, eyeshadow, eyeshadow goes onto the under eye. Under I under use under. baby wipe or makeup mm -hmm. wipe. And then put foundation because wow. this part of the face is the most uh, prominent part of the face. Pencil liner is something that's kind of uh, slippery, and if you don't set it with eyeshadow or powder, it's gonna move. So well, I like I the nose of always with eyeshadow over pencil liner. In the end, I use lip gloss in the inner part of the face. Wow, she's so pretty. Oh my god. Next, let's watch the let's watch the video of Go Packing. Go Packing with Gazini Ganados. Go pack go packing secrets. So cool. Hi everyone, it's me Gazini Ganados mm -hmm. from the Philippines and I'm gonna give you some tips and tricks of how so I pack. Pretty. So right now I have me as my personal luggage, mm. toiletries, jewelry, jewelry. gym, wow. silicon bra. How many suitcases total do you pack to come here? Seven, including my national costume. Wow. It's so fragile and it has to be transported in a very special way. What's the best trick for packing that you've learned over all these years? Separating it and also rolling your your things. What's the one item that you absolutely need? Toiletries. Toiletries. You have to bring so many things for you to be able to maintain your skin. When yeah, you're flying, yeah. you're so dehydrated, so oh. you know you have to patch things up right after. Wow. Very nice from Gazini Ganados. Next, let's watch the Go Arrivals to Atlanta with Gazini again and Frederica Alexis Cole. Go Arrivals to Atlanta. Case is wrapped in foil. Yeah, just to make sure that you know it stays extra, extra safe. Yeah. <laughs> That's the most fragile thing you got to do. Oh, my dress. She's so cute. There were a lot of Filipinos waiting for me in the airport a while ago, and then I just got this from them. Wow, so nice. I only have six bags. Six dollars. Plus one, seven, her national costume. Oh. How are you feeling about the time difference? Well, I'm a little jet lagged, but I think all the excitement is making up for it. I also mm. gotta open up a cable tie. <laughs> I got it. You got it. Done. <laughs> so cute. Next, we have the This Insecurity Doesn't Stop Miss Universe Vietnam. Yeah, let's watch her. <laughs> This is a mid Vietnam. So actually, I wrote a letter for somebody who received it, but I really want to share with all of you. I have a big scar in my face when I was one years old, and I was very insecure about that. Scared to look at people's eyes because I scared that they want to see my scar. I think about my scar and I say, oh, maybe not. Maybe I would not be a model because I have big scar. I got green Vietnam next top model. I'm here to represent my country. So I just want to tell all people, if you're insecure about your scar or yourself, just be accept yourself because if you accept yourself, people will accept you. And I'm here. I did it. Build it. Wow. Very nice from Miss Universe Vietnam. Next, 
so yeah i'm very excited about the miss universe on monday so let's watch let's watch from singapore must know packing essentials for long term singapore hi everyone i'm moana prabha silvam and i'm Whoa. representing singapore in the miss universe 2019 i would want to share some few tips and tricks with you in terms of packing this bag is actually things that i stock up on foundation concealer and then my eyeshadow palettes neutral ones some pop of colors primer my foundation brushes with small handle very important powder and lipsticks too what would be the most devastating thing that you needed that you didn't have i would say lipstick i'm a lipstick kind of girl is there any trick to keeping anything from spilling firstly you have to like really see if it's tight but i don't go the extra mile to bag it up but i think you should Did you ever get stuck in customs with all these final rules? Everything goes into the check-in luggage. Only this one comes with me on board. Yeah. Miss Universe Singapore. Next we have Miss Universe India. 11 suitcase, 10 days. Oh my god. Representing India at Miss Universe, and oh, right so now we're standing also. in our room. We definitely have like few things because you have wow. to dress up all the time, maybe thrice a day, four times a day. So you should know what you have kept where. So talking about the number of suitcases I have, in total I have about five suitcases. So my clutches are here: wow. nude, gold, black, large. In my room for now, like I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Just seven suitcases, jewelry boxes. Here are a few pieces. These are the diamond section that I have. Bracelets, 17 earrings I have in this box. And I want to make sure that I'm like putting on my best look every day. So yeah, 11 suitcases for 10 days, and I'm traveling very light, guys. Oh my god! Like it's just so much. And maybe I need another suitcase. <laughs> 11 suitcases in 10 days. That's a lot. Yeah. Next, we will watch the. Short clip of South Africa. South Africa. South Africa is so alluring. I have thirty minutes or less, which I have almost all the time. I like her beauty. I like to cheat my makeup a lot, so I will use a bold lip. Could be red or pink, which are my favorite colors. Instead of I make up South Africa, I use this secret trick. Oh my god. So literally it's just me applying a bright lip. Mm -hmm. So I notice you're not you're not using lip liner. Yeah, so lip liner takes a lot of time and I don't really have much of that right now, so I'll just go for the lipstick. I didn't wear a lipstick until I was about 23 mm -hmm. and my sister gave me a tutorial in about 2 hours and then I was set from then on. Um so she taught me a lot about changing lips because then um you have different looks for it and different eyes you know things like day makeup night makeup um when you're going out for dinner for instance you need to have a darker lip uh, mm -hmm. a darker eye and maybe a little bright lip as well and then during the day just tone it down a bit with the liner and the smoky eye when I'm on a time crunch this is usually my bestest best friend this is highlighter and i usually go for this gold color because i love how it pops so it's it's kind of like cheating you get that glow without having to put in all the effort so usually i'll just literally put it on the side of my cheeks just across you the most important trick is to put it where the sun hits so when you're looking at the sun where it first hits which is usually above your cheek um it's usually on your brow line um it's usually at the bridge of your nose just blend that out a little and if you want some as well i usually like to put on the forehead just to get a little bit of that instant glow wow. as well and then lastly on nice my chin, tips from south needs. africa <laughs> Yeah, so I usually go for the much golder one because like it looks really um good on my um on my skin as well. It pops nicely. The other ones tend to be a, a little yellow and maybe a little too bright, but this one blends really naturally on my skin. So, I'll share my secret with you. 
guys. <laughs> so if I don't have time to do eye makeup, and for me it takes so long to get my eyelashes on, I can't seem to get the right and fast way to do it. So I'll just put on my bold lip, I'll put on my highlighter, and then I will end it off with a nice hair shake. Mm -hmm. And just like that, under 10 minutes, we are ready to go. So nice. Wow. So we are all excited about coronation of the Miss Universe, guys. So what can you say about their uh, short clips? So just comment down below. And if you have any suggestions for my next video reaction, just comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel, guys. See you to my next vlog. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe my channel and see you to my next vlog guys.